Good evening, my name is Taloria Gray. This evening, we will explore how technology has changed the way we communicate today. We no longer need to find a landline to make a telephone call, a business center to fax a document, or even an internet cafe to Google some information for work or school. We have immediate access to all things that cell phone, with a cell phone. Dr. Henry T. Sampson, Jr. is a major contributor to the development of the cell phone. He co-invented the gamma cell, a necessary component for the modern-day cellular phone. Dr. Sampson, from Jackson, Mississippi, began his educational journey in 1951 at Morehouse College in Atlanta, Georgia. He later transferred to Purdue University in Illinois, where he received his bachelor degree in chemical engineering. By 1967, he had earned his PhD in nuclear engineering from the University of Illinois at Urbana-Campaign, Illinois. Dr. Sampson is the first African-American in the United States to receive this degree. Now, in 1971, he co-invented the gamma electric cell with George H. Miley, who would later go on to patent the first cell phone by 1973. Even though the cell phone has been identified as one of Dr. Sampson's inventions, the gamma electric cell converts high radiation, which is also known as gamma rays, to electricity, which is necessary for the modern day cell phone to function. Dr. Sampson holds several U.S. patents, which focus on the development of rocket fuels, and Dr. Sampson is considered a pioneer in technology. He is mostly known for the invention that is used in modern cell phones. So the next time you pick up your cell phone, remember, had it not been for Dr. Henry T. Sampson Jr., this piece of technology might not be possible. For Inventing Our History, I'm Taloria Gray.